Hello and welcome to our series on how to edit content on the UB website. Today we're going to learn about how to log in to the UB website and edit your staff profile. So you've gone to the UB website www.ub.bw and then you simply scroll down to the bottom of the screen and select on UB login. If you know your username and password, simply type them in. Otherwise, you can click on forgot password and enter in your username or email address for Mupipi and click on submit. You will receive an email regarding your login details. However, since we know our username and password, we're simply going to type them in and then select on the login button. To edit your staff profile, you simply click on edit profile on the top left hand side and you'll be given an opportunity to edit things like your password or even update your email address to be your Office 365 email address. If you want to update your staff profile picture, simply click on Browse and then select on the profile picture of choice. And please be sure to enter in your name against your profile picture as this will be used for accessibility purposes. Simply then scroll down and go ahead and give a brief description about your profile, your professional qualifications and your biography, your teaching areas, research areas, and supervision areas or research areas for postgraduate studies. And be sure to include your publications in the APA style. You can also edit information regarding your office number or telephone number. And when you are satisfied with the changes, click on save at the bottom. and you have edited your staff profile successfully. To view your changes, you can simply select on View Profile, and you'll be able to view your profile once you're still logged into the UB website. To log out of the UB website, you can simply select on Log Out at the top, and to view your staff profile as a visitor to the website, you can go to Connect, select on Staff Directory, and then search for yourself in the Staff Directory. I'm simply going to type in my last name and click on Search. And now I'll be able to view my profile as a visitor of the website. And so there you have it. You've edited your staff profile and indicated your professional qualifications, a brief biography about yourself, and your teaching, research, and postgraduate supervision areas, as well as your publications. Thank you for tuning in and goodbye.